what's up taurus i'm back thank you guys for watching my channel she's got the gift taurus sun moon rising and venus sign back with your daily i thank you guys for all your likes your comments and your subscribes i ask that you guys please continue to do so to all the new subscribers thank you guys for rocking with me i thank you guys for having my back i have yours too tenfold let's jump right into your reading take what's for you out the reading taurus and lead the rest okay you know it ain't gonna fit to a t because it's a it's a general it's not a personal you know that and keep in mind, roles could be reversed. I could be saying man or woman more than the other, but you know your story better than I do. We're just trying to get down to the bottom of it, okay? I love you, Taurus. Thank you guys for rocking with me. I'm truly grateful to have you. Let's jump into it. Spirit, white light, holy angels, I call upon you to guide me. Thank you for using me as a vessel. I'm truly grateful to be guiding, Taurus. Please allow abundance to flow into the Taurus life. Spiritual growth, financial wealth health, well-being, and allow their souls to cry so that they can be cleansed for all the new to come in. Taurus, you got some good things coming towards you. No weapon be informed against the Taurus shall prosper. We truly grateful. Thank you. Please protect me as I channel for you. Please block out any negativity, any interference. No weapon be informed against the Taurus shall prosper. I feel like I needed to say that again. I don't know why. All right, let's go. What's going on with the Taurus for today's spirit? Three crowning messages for Taurus daily. Please and thank you. It's all love. It's all love. Mm -hmm. I don't know who that is. You got true love, mutual loyalty, and true love. Something that's coming towards you here. You got no at the bottom of this deck. And you got getting to know you again. Yeah, somebody wants to see the real you. Stop holding up a mask when it comes to this person. Let this person know just how you feel. Show this person your true inner side. And if you need to get in touch with your divine feminine side, do that. Allow this person to break down those barriers for you. Don't stay stuck and stagnant because of some shit you went through. Please don't drag that on to your next relationship, Taurus. Look at that divine protection. Mm-hmm. Divine protection is here, baby. And then you got new life. Somebody could be finding out they, that they expecting here. We're going to get into it and get a little bit more deeper than this. It's like your spirit guides is removing you from one situation, putting you into something that's better, that's going to prosper tenfold here. Um, somebody says something. Somebody spoke something into existence and it's here. What's going on with this spirit? What's going on with this new life? Who is this? The Taurus? It's like something is being given to you here. That's amazing. What's going on with Taurus spirit? Could you give me a little bit more information on this new life? Who is this? Somebody could be pregnant. Mm -hmm. I heard by January somebody gonna find out they pregnant. Ooh, we mm -hmm. better you than me. Mm -hmm. No ma'am, no ham, no turkey. What's this new life spirit? It's like whatever this is that you're about to come into is protected. Go walk into this with joy. Lift your head held high. If there's no more cries. There's no more storms here. Something is being divinely given to you and it's also protected by the Most High here. You got it. This new life, it could be a new job. Somebody finna get a promotion. Somebody's just finna start something very amazing here. Something new, something bigger, something better. Okay. And this is totally you. Somebody wants to work with you too. Whoever's a painter, whoever likes to paint, somebody likes what they see. What other messages you have with this new life and this three of pentacles spirit? That new job, ooh, it's coming sooner than you know. Ooh, yes, honey, yes. Uh-huh. Yep, Taurus. You getting it. Whatever you want, it's coming. And it's going to happen fast. I, a blink of an eye, I literally see somebody blink and your whole life is about to change completely for the better here. You also could have some um, information coming in from... Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or Gemini. Somebody wants to work with you. It's it's a fire sign or an air sign that wants to work with you. Or it could be another uh, earth sign as well. This is, I don't feel, I don't pick up no bad vibes from this. A 
yeah, uh, Taurus, over the next few weeks, you're going to be working real hard. But they said this is what you this is what you want. Here's the thing with this. This money or this new job or it's like, thank you. They said take this new card. Okay. It's like there you are going to be put in this prominent position where it's going to be all eyes on you, Taurus. Now, I just got to tell you this. All money ain't good money, okay? Because from the looks of this, you're going to be getting money, but it's like... It's going to become a lot for you. You're going to be over these next two weeks, two to eight weeks, they keep saying. Like, something is about to change drastically for the better, but don't let material change who you are. Because you can start making so much money every week and then get to, you know, get into the, the, the material realm and forget about the spiritual realm. Don't do that, Taurus. Don't let the material get the best of you here, okay? It's like this boss man. It's this. It's a male figure that wants to work with you. This could either be a Capricorn or um, uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Now, this Capricorn is very controlling. They're gonna want you to do what they say. When they say jump, they're gonna want you to say how high. That's what I'm saying. I don't know. Don't let this control you just because you need money right now or like. It's something to do with the way you get your money. All of a sudden, things are going to start picking up and you're going to start making more money. But it's like somebody wants to control you. So don't allow that to. Something about this Capricorn wants to control everything that they do. Everything that you do. It's like they expect you to always be there. This person is going to expect you to work long hours or give you extra days or like, you know, add on to some. you going to be making money here. Four, five, six, seven with the seven of pentacles out here. You got the three of pentacles with the four of pentacles. The seven of pentacles out here. It's all this time is going to be invested into whatever this is that's going on here. You're going to have one controlling motherfucker in your ear that wants to control everything you do. And it's like, I'm giving you this or you got to thank me because you're making this amount of money or something like that is going to happen with this new job here. This person is also going to be sexually attracted to you. Never mix, never mix business with pleasure. They telling me to tell you. Ooh, okay. They said one more card. It's like this job is going. This new life, this job, this this extra money you get, this extra stream of income. It's like it's going to become too much for you. Somebody is trying to control you because of money. They know you material. It ain't even that you materialistic. I know, Taurus, you guys like to dress to impress. You like to find things in life. And somebody sees that this is one of your weaknesses, so they're going to try to control you with it. Your boss. It's a boss that's going to try to control you with it. They're going to try to throw wine at you every now and then or cookie every now and then at you. Don't go for it. This person is very good at what they do. They're a charmer. They're toxic. This is like a control freak. Thank you, Spirit. Uh-huh, that's going to be watching your every move you make. Every move you make. This this boss could have been watching you for a long time. Now they're getting ready with the eight of wands to, to, to come in quick. Hey, let's get this, let's get this show on the world. Let's work, work. Let's work, work, work. This is all I'm seeing. Work, 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 work. You're going to be overwhelmed with this, Taurus. But this is what you asked for. Okay, what's this divine protection for Taurus spirit? They said not this day. Okay. What's this divine protection? Can you give me a little bit more on this spirit? Somebody could have a, a Libra Gemini in the background, um, like learning from you, also stalking you as well. Like somebody is stalking you so much to the point now they're beginning to like how you move and they're actually learning from you now. So that's a good thing and a bad thing because you got a fucking stalker, but this person's picking up good habits from you. You are very toxic. Somebody finna get into a relationship or workship with a very toxic boss here. Very controlling boss. What's this divine protection about, spirit? What's this divine protection about for Taurus? So you are divinely protected from somebody from your past. If you want to take this person back, you can. You got the, you got the heads up. I guess this person has made the necessary changes to do, do that. And also, um, you're protected from this per the way you think about this person or the memories that, that comes back around pertaining to this person. It's like spirit is saying, no, are they just bringing up the bad memories because this person is not good. This person was a very toxic person. They wasn't good for your soul. So this is why you're being dividedly 
divine protection from this person, like from your past, period. You're protected. It could be a Cancer Pisces Scorpio that's in their feelings now wanting to come back and give you your flowers here. Or right, this person looks up to you like you, this person is spiritually blocked, period. This person looks up to you now, though. Or like it's something you did to this person. Now they can see the bigger picture in life here. But at the end of the day, you they you protect it from them coming towards you. Either way it go, this person like sits and think about you uh towards all day long, consistently saying your name or the conversation that's being talked about. It's you here. This is why you always think about this person out of the blue. Or like, you know what I mean? Memories get to come back around and shit because this person know what they doing. This person know you spiritual as fuck. They know if they keep chanting your name and keep your name in their mouth here, you gonna, they gonna run back into you or something like that. But don't worry about it. This is said and done right here. You are protected from this person for a reason. So, you know, this, this protection was good for you. Don't take it as a bad thing. Uh, uh, Taurus, this money is coming in here. Don't worry, you protected. If you was worrying about paying a bill or something, it, it it's better to be late than never. It's better to always go to work, even if you show up thirty minutes late. You're there. It's okay. So don't worry about when the money is coming and how it's coming. Just know that it is coming and it's on its way. Okay. You protected from this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, but I've been telling you this, this little snake right here been in your in your energy for a very long time. You protected from them too. I told you, this person keep trying shit and trying shit with this wine here and this black cat trying all this spell work and shit on you, but you protected from it. This is why the shit keep backfiring on her. If you look at the person, yo, yo, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, feminine, or, men, or, or um, masculine, you can tell this person is getting older. They look older in the face. They starting to get bags under their eyes. They could have eczema on their hands or on their legs or something like that. Like their skin is lighter than, like they got light patches on their face, on their neck. Ooh, wait, uh, Taurus. This, um, this, um, Cancer Pisces Scorpio, the Ar Leo, Aries or Sagittarius is just like, don't want, they don't want you to walk away, but it, it's already done. You already selling off here, so don't look back. Is that it for divine protection for Torah? Ooh. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Ooh, look at that, Taurus. You got the you got the nine of pentacles that flew out. Like I told you, whatever you need here is coming. You protect it. Whatever you spoke out loud, that new job. Yeah, they keep saying this new job, Taurus. This new job. Just don't be fooled by the material, the, the glitter and all the gold and shit that's coming towards you. Is I don't know. It's here for a reason. But look, this divinely protection. You got something new coming towards you too. We're gonna clarify that and see what's coming on here. You got a new job coming towards you. A whole new life here. Like like you're gonna be receiving this messages quick over the over the next course of two or eight weeks. Between there, your your life is gonna change for the better. It's like you coming more grounded with yourself here. You you more responsible. The spirit sees that. God knows that you are the one for this task here. You're responsible. You take care of home. You pay what needs to be paid. People, you are very dependable. People love what they see about you. Somebody wants to come in and give you something here. And this person that, that's, um, it's like another Taurus or Virgo or Capricorn wants to give you something. This person is not selfish. They give in. They trust work. They trustworthy. They care about you. They take your feelings into consideration. And boom, here go the Ace of Pentacles. You asked for this though. It's like yo yo manifestations, baby. Manifest for me, Taurus. Please put me in your manifestations because this shit is coming. This is good. Who is this true love coming to Taurus spirit? Oh, no. Okay. Look, you always got a negative nasty or a Debbie Downer in your in your energy field. Look, Ace of Cups here, something is new. You dead in some shit. You this transformation is here. Yeah, with the star here. Yes, Taurus. Yes, you did the inner work. That transformation is coming. I'm proud of you. About time that energy's clearing out. What's this true love about for Taurus Spirit? What's this true love about for Taurus? We truly grateful.
You ain't got to worry about that. It's like you've been taking your spiritual baths or doing all the shit that you need to do to be protected. Now they got you. They heard you. They hear you. You protected from this Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. You protected from this uh, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. You got a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn that's coming in. A relationship is protected if you want to take it farther with them. You got a brand new opportunity that's coming that's not going to pass you up because you protected. Your name is on it. Mm, okay. Mm -hmm. I love you, Taurus. What's this true love about for Taurus spirit? <clears throat> it could be a Capricorn you dealing with, with the sun here and the devil. There's true love. It's like you happy with the person. Let me tell you something, Taurus. You need to stop self-sabotaging shit, too, because you let that little mind wander of yours and then whoop, there it is. You know what I mean? Then you back here complaining to me. Shit. Don't move so fast with this person. It's true love that's coming towards you, and it could turn into this right here. It could literally come from this person that you're supposed to be working with. You start dibbling and dabbling in the cookie jar here. But I told you, never mix business with pleasure. So don't do that. Wait for something better. Whoever this true love is, it could be a, it could be a fire sign. Leo in particular or Capricorn here that you're going to run into. You're going to be with for a very long time. You and this person compliment each other. This person could turn possessive over you, you know, because they know the shit that you've been through and they want to do anything to make you happy. I don't feel like this, this devil, I don't feel, I'm not picking up no bad energy from this person. It's just like, you know, they, they want you. They want to be your protector, your security here at all. Like, yeah. Okay. Is that it for true love? Is that it, spirit? You second guessing it or you thinking twice about this, but you got the eight of swords out here and the, and the seven of pentacles for a reason, baby. For a reason. Somebody could be 44 here. You seeing four, four, four a lot. Yeah, yeah, your guy's right there next to you. Like, baby girl, baby boy, come on, let's do this. You got this. Stop overthinking the situation. They said one more card out of this deck. Okay. Any other messages with this true love? It's like this thing, this true love got the, oh, yes, baby, yes. You got the ace of wands here and then the five of pentacles in reverse. With the seven of pentacles and the ace of wands, ace of pentacles, you, like this is here. This is it. The sun card. Hey, baby, I'm here to make you happy. What's up? <laughs> Taurus, you got a lot of people that's sexually attracted to you, too. This is where the infatuation is going to come from. This true love, this new love or true love, this is divinely protected. This is who you're supposed to be with right now. This person is here to show you what true love is and to make you happy at all costs. What the five of pentacles here is in, in here in reverse. They're not going to do shit to fuck this up, period, Taurus. Um, but this is where the infatuation going to come from. You're going to put that cookie on them a lot. Are they going to put that wand on you a lot? This is where the infatuation is going to come from, baby boy, baby girl. So, I don't know what you need to be doing, baby. You need to put some ice down there. Cool that off, okay? Because it's going to turn infatuation here. I just heard fatal attraction. I got to give y'all what I hear. Could you clarify this Ace of Pentacles for Taurus spirit? Thank you for your time, Taurus. I'm truly grateful for you. Don't forget to hit the like, comment, and subscribe button for me, please. And thank you. What's this Ace of Pentacles about? You said clarify. What's this Ace of Pentacles about? The temperance. Oof. Yes, baby. Yes. You being gifted more. Um, you like your psychic ability is on fire right now with the Queen of Wands and the Temperance here. It's like you, you, yeah, you becoming this person. You becoming stronger and wiser. Something is opening up for you. Divine got you. Period. This is a gift from the universe. And one of them is to be protected financially, protected, stable protected uh with love here like everything here you look at that you got the seven uh swords here in reverse you are protected from any snake any harm any deceptive kind that's trying to come and slither in your grass you are protected baby girl baby boy i hope this helped you taurus okay i love you guys also what's next for you is coming out okay so we're gonna follow up with this since you know you got the new life coming the true love and you already protected what's next Okay, is it going to last a long time? What well, What's up, Spirit? Give us a little bit more. Love you, Taurus. Talk to you later. Peace.